Hi Norman. Hi there. <laughs> what do well, you think about the coffee in this hotel? Yes. Have you got a nice coffee there? Oh, fantastic. Yeah? Good cappuccino in here. Oh, oh really? What did you get? Oh, just out of a thing. Uh, <laughs> just out of a cloud. <laughs> Where did you get yours? Right around at the, um, the restaurant, right around the corner, the bar. Right, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. good, yeah. good. Where yeah. are you staying up? Like, Where are you from then? What, I'm you? from the States. I was born in LA and grew up in Philadelphia, so I ended up in Japan for 22 years, so that's why, why I am like this. I teach Japanese culture at embassies. And oh, that's enough. That's it. You're bloody making me feel insignificant. <laughs> Thank you, I've got an incredible You look great, right. you look great, right. yeah. Uh, welcome, welcome to and this uh, sunny... Yes, this is, wow, lovely this is great. See, yeah. it wasn't like this yesterday. It's like this just for you. What's your name? Karen. Karen, if only it was just me and you talking now, we could, you know, we could take ah. somewhere else. <laughs> Bar's right over there. Yeah, we'll uh, meet for a cappuccino later. Uh, that's, that's it, indeed. Karen, what, what are you going to ask me? Yes, I was going to ask, um, first of all, I really admire the fact that you have this temper because directors traditionally have them, and why are they allowed to have them and actors aren't? Um, taking it to the extreme is one thing, but then again, you know, it's just as though the actors have to do everything the director says. They're allowed to have a temper. Well, uh, what about Tom Cruise? Where they, where they oh. that war transit? Now you lost him with you jerk. Yeah, hey. yeah. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, they're people just like we are. So, do you have any mentors in this business? Anybody that you really, during your career, you said, oh yeah, this is the person that I really admire and want to emulate or want to do my best to reach the same level oh, of achievement? That's a good, that's a good question. And, uh, I, I really can't think of anybody. I mean, I just admired a, a few actors and performers. Rick Mayer was probably a performer I admired enormously in the early days. Yeah, and, and I love the way that when we'd go out, uh, he'd, he'd, you know, people upset him. He'd, he'd get upset too, and I thought, I like that. Yeah, he'd tell them, you know, uh, he'd get pissed, and sometimes he'd overstep the mark, and so would I. And I just thought, well, that's all right, you know. <laughs> But, you know, those were those days so when we were at that age. I mean, I don't drink now, so... I still listen to that, but, <laughs> but no, I, I don't miss drinking as well, really, because I think drinking's for when you're young, really. I, I think it is, it is poisonous, and uh, I had a problem with it, so... You know, if, I think, no, I think if you, can, if you can sip a glass of wine for an hour, or nurse a pint for an hour, then good for you, but I couldn't. No. I bloody couldn't do any nursing oh. in that department, you know. I'd have to sink the thing and let's get the next one in. You know. <laughs> but that's the way it, way it is, yeah. Um, I can't really name, but, but Rick Mayer would probably be one of them. Yeah, I admired him and all.